brain. <laughs> oh! Ah, oh, these are perfect. The most delicious mug shrooms. I just need a few more for my special mug shroom soup. I can't wait for Ruby, Joy, and Hope to try it. <laughs> But what if they don't like it? I like it, but then I like everything. What... what if my soup is no good? Oh, why did I invite them over for dinner? I'm not ready for this. I haven't even finished getting everything I need. Oh. What if I make the soup too thick? Oh, that would be horrible. Oh, no. Hi, Boo! Sorry we're late. We were watching the fairy friends, trying to get some pointers. I brought a loaf of lem tack for us to have with the soup. We're really excited to try it. I brought taste buds. I assume that's all we needed. Oh, I... Uh, hi, everyone. The soup. Right, yes. Uh, did I say there would be soup? You definitely mentioned soup. You were all about your special mog shroom soup. Yes, I remember you said it's my favorite dish. I'll have to make it for you guys. Why don't you come over for dinner tomorrow? Did you forget? Oh, no. I just thought well, we could do something different. Different? I hope that still involves dinner. Yes, uh, what I mean is something different for dinner. Anyone for acorn? Acorn? Just acorn. Mm. Delicious. Uh-huh. Oh, but Boo, you said you were making your soup. I remember when you made it last time. It smelled so delicious. Well, I... I don't even have any mug shrooms. Then what are these? Uh, I guess I do have mug shrooms. Silly me. Yay! <laughs> Soup's back on! Will you need any help, Boo? Uh, no. No, no. You guys just uh, make yourselves comfortable. <laughs> Oh, dear. What am I going to do? They're really excited about the soup. I wish I hadn't told the others my soup was so good. They'll be so sad when it's not. Ah! Oh. 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 No! Ah! What's going on? Are you okay? Oh. Interesting technique. I've just been really worried you guys won't like my soup. And now everything is going wrong. Oh, Boo, don't worry. You're a great cook. I'm sure we'll all think your soup is tasty. And even if we don't, that's okay. You can make us one of your delicious Mogwort sandwiches. <laughs> you guys like my sandwiches? Uh, they're okay. Joy! Uh, what? Okay. They're great. You happy? Very. Come on, Boo. Let's make some soup. We'll help you. <gasps> Another one. <laughs> <laughs> wow, three of them. No wonder you were feeling bad. They've been giving you worry vibes. I can do this. Okay. Who wants mushroom soup? And mugwort sandwiches. Yay! Yay! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> it's finally here. The new extra gummy multi sherbet rainbow rific lollipop. Over 300 flavors. And I can't wait to take a bite. <laughs> my tooth! My tooth! Oh no! What am I gonna do? Oh dear. Another child believer has got a toothache. Huh? But she's terrified of the dentist. Dentist? What's a dentist? Their masks. Their long white coats. And especially their tools. Tools? Right, that's it. No tooth tinkering, mask wearing, ghost dentist is going anywhere near my mouth with tools. A spoonful of mushroom mulch. <laughs> hey, Boo! Do you have a... What? Toothache? Who said anything about me having a toothache? I don't have a toothache. Um, no, I was gonna ask if you have any mushroom mulch. I've lost mine. Oh! <laughs> um, no, but you know what works just as well? Toadstool juice. Awesome! Oh, hang on! The book says it makes a horrible smell once you add the mulch, so we better wear these. Huh? Ah! Boo? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> the ghost dentist! <laughs> it's real! It's really real! Ah! Can't go to the dentist! Won't go to the dentist! Ah! Ah! You, you need to watch where you're flying, Boo. Oh, sorry, Hope. W what's that? Oh, this? Something I've been making for the fairy friends. Wanna see? Sure. It's a oh! music box to help believers get to sleep. Boo? Stay away from my mouth! Hmm? Queen Kate, thank goodness! Oh, what's wrong? We need your help to find Boo. He's gone missing. Oh dear. He seemed really scared of, uh, something. He was talking about toothache? And he called me a ghost dentist. And now we can't find him anywhere. Hmm, sounds like someone's worried about their teeth. Come on, fairies. I think I know where he might be. I wish I didn't have to go to the dentist. Ugh. I wish I didn't have to go to the dentist. The wishing seats, of course. Oh, uh, nothing to see here. Just feeding the fish. It's okay, Boo. We know why you're here. You do? Oh, please, Queen Kate. Don't take me to the dentist, ghost monster. I beg of you. Oh, Boo. Dentists aren't monsters. Look. Their job is to make your teeth feel better, not worse. It... It is? Of course. So what about the tools? Why do they use screwdrivers and hammers on your teeth? <laughs> Not that kind of tool. They have special dentist tools. They use them to give your teeth a nice clean and get rid of any nasty things that might damage them. Oh, well, I guess that's not so scary. Now, what do you say? Shall we have a look at that sore tooth of yours? Uh, okay. Wonderful! Our very own Fairy Valley Dentist is on his way. I hear somebody's got a toothache. Don't worry, Boo. Just try to focus on something else. Here, how about some music? And what about some magic fairy dust? Thanks, guys. This will really help keep my mind off it. Ahem. I'm already done. Huh? You are? My tooth. It feels amazing. Mmm. It even tastes amazing. <laughs> That's my special Whizzleberry toothpaste. Thanks, Nordman. And thank you all for helping me. <laughs> no problem, Boo. You see, there was nothing to be scared of. You're right, Queen Kate. Even so, I think I'd better stay away from the extra gummy multi sherbet rainbow rific lollipops. <laughs> you got it, Boo! Uh, oh, 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 pickling pixies, that was a close 
one. Your shots are always a close one. It's yours, Joy! You get it. All righty! You nearly missed. Joy, I hope you don't mind me saying, but you don't seem very happy today. Is everything all right? Yeah, you've been even more grouchy than usual. Do you feel okay? Your wing blossom game has been way off. Would you like one of my homemade cotton candy crystal Q-tips to cheer you up? It's my newest tasty creation. You hit that amazingly! Wanna play another match? Why are you always asking me things? What's with all the questions all the time? Why can't you guys just leave me alone? That was quite a lot of questions. Oh. Uh, uh. Oh, you're in quite a hurry there, Joy. Sorry, Queen Kate. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't be silly. I've bumped into bigger, smellier things in the human world than a fairy. Aren't you going to make a comment about big, smelly fairies? Nope. Are you quite all right, Joy? You don't seem yourself. I don't think I've been very nice to my friends. I kept saying rude things. I didn't mean to, but they were annoying me. What were they doing to annoy you? We were playing Wing Blossom, and they kept hitting it. Isn't that the point of the Wing Blossom game? I guess so. And usually I dislike that game a lot less than our other games. So what was different about today? <sighs> Joy, I was on my way to the forest. Would you like to join me? Mm. Do you know what these are, Joy? Trees, obviously. Yes, but do you know what types of trees? Mm. These are the shouting trees. Whenever a fairy feels angry, they come here and shout their frustrations and feelings at the trees. You shout at the trees? Why? Everyone feels down sometimes, and it helps to put those inside feelings into words. This helps us understand what is making us feel bad. Why don't you give it a go? Mm. Off you go. I feel annoyed at my friends. A little louder. I feel frustrated that I didn't enjoy the game of Wing Blossom. Just a tad louder. I feel angry because none of my friends understand me today. I feel upset because I can't tell them about my problems. <laughs> what are your problems, Joy? Do you feel as though you can tell me? My big sister became a fairy friend today. Well, that's fantastic news! You must be over the moon for her. I am, but it means that now she won't live with me, so I won't see her much. A worry came through the worry plaque today from a believer who was worried about their best friend moving to a different school. The idea of seeing less of someone you care about is an upsetting thought. But you know, everyone always makes time for those they are closest to. And even if you don't get to see one person as much as you'd like, you'll always have other people who care about you. That's true! Oh, don't worry about Tristan. He likes to get his frustrations out, too. It makes me feel as light as a leaf! <laughs> How are you feeling now, Joy? Much better. I wish I'd spoken about it sooner. It might make you feel even better if you speak about it some more. A problem shared is a problem halved. So, I wanted to say sorry about this morning. I was taking all of my sadness about my sister leaving out on you, when really I should have just told you about it in the first place. I was worried that you wouldn't understand. That's okay, Joy. We all feel that way sometimes. My cousin used to live next door to me. When my parents told me he was moving, I was so upset that I didn't paint for a whole week. It must be scary thinking that you won't see your sister as much. But just think, soon you'll be able to share stories of your exciting fairy friend missions with her. We all will. Now, I think it's my turn to serve. Pass me the blossom, Bud Ruby. <laughs> 